Another unique way to cool off this summer is with a crushy from Ten Barrel Brewing. What is it? You will find out because I stopped by Ten Barrel to try out the secret to this new creation. This is the crushy machine. I was so intrigued. I keep hearing about this. I keep seeing it on Instagram and I'm like, I need to go figure out what is happening. How do you turn a beer into a slushy? It sounds like a good idea if you execute it well, right? Because if I tried to do this, like if I had a slushy machine at home, it would probably taste disgusting. But we are up here on the rooftop at Ten Barrel in Northwest Portland, which by the way, doesn't look super nice out right now, but it is warm. It is wonderful, very delightful temperature and perfect temperature for a crushy. We have Allison here at the pub. Okay, what is a crushy? Crushy is essentially our sour beers turned into a slushy. So we have, right now we have both our raspberry and our lemon crush in there right now. It's gonna be the most delightful refreshing drink we'll have all summer. Now for the people sitting at home thinking, sour beer, beer slushy, this sounds like a weird idea. What would you say to that? <laughs> it is a weird idea, but we did it. We made it work and it honestly, proofs in the taste. It's fantastic. We're selling like crazy and we love them. Okay, I have to taste these. Can we pour pour them? So you said right now you have the lemon and the raspberry because Ten Barrel for a while has done a bunch of different sour beers. If you don't know, they're called the Crush, right? That's where the Crushy comes from? Correct, yeah. So and we you have, guys just came out with a new one too? Yes, we did. We just came out with our Strawberry Crush. That's going to be available at the end of the month in all of our pubs. And that's also going to be in our new variety pack for our crushes. Oh, and you've got the compostable straws and everything in true oh, Portland oh, yeah. fashion. This is the raspberry one. Is it just beer into a slushie or do you mix other things into it? No, it's our special little concoction that we do. We throw in a little simple, a little couple extra things, make it, you know, freeze quite nicely. Can't give it all away, right. but it's not just the beer. Because like I said, if we try this at home, it would not work very well. Okay, let me taste this. Lemon. And how sour is the lemon? What should I be expecting? You should definitely expect a lot of lemon flavor, but not overly tart by any means. Nice and sweet, yeah? That's so delicious. Whoa, that's cool. Okay, now the raspberry one. What about this one? How sour? The raspberry that? packs more of a punch, but definitely well balanced. Whoa. Yeah, that's interesting because it a lot just tastes like a raspberry or a lemon, very tart, slushy, but then it does have a little bit of the beer taste. That's delicious. How do you guys do so many magical things? Okay, so you said there's gonna be a strawberry one towards the end of the month. What else can people expect? How long do they have to come here and try out the crushy? You have until summer to come and try it out. We might keep doing it into the fall. We'll kind of, you know, test it out. We're definitely in the uh, experimental process right now, but might as well come sooner the better. I will say, even if it wasn't nice out, like if it was winter, this would make me feel like I was on a tropical vacation, so. Yeah, if you want like a little escape, there you go. Yeah, exactly. Okay, well come try the lemon, the raspberry crushy here at Ten Barrel in the Pearl. Ah, so refreshing. Perfect for a mermaid, really. So go try a crushy.